New details on a double shooting that happened in Rosedale, Queens. CBS News New York is learning three people are now in custody. Shows Bedrosian has been reporting on this story and has the latest details. Two people are recovering from gunshot wounds after a shooting happened in broad daylight right here in Rosedale, Queens, Thursday evening. We're learning those two victims are a 75-year-old man and a 14-year-old girl. A video on the scene shows police canvassing the 243rd Street and Weller Avenue after neighbors say they were startled by gunfire around 4.30 p.m. Some say they heard between four to six gunshots go off. A shocking sound for what neighbors say is a quiet community that rarely ever has gun violence. One of those victims is a 75-year-old man who is known around the neighborhood for riding a green bicycle and collecting bottles. Neighbors say he goes to the church down the street and is friendly with people on the block. Witnesses tell CBS News New York he had blood dripping down his face after police say he was shot in the jaw while riding his bike. Sources believe he was not the intended target. As for the second victim, a neighbor who heard the gunshots go off says she called 911 after finding the 14-year-old girl with a gunshot wound to her leg hiding behind a car. She was in a state of shock and panic. I was on the call with 911, so I, I did know about the gentleman, the older gentleman. I saw her first immediately after I heard the gunshots. And um, I, I was on the call with 911, so I informed them that we needed an ambulance for her. Three people are now in custody for the shooting, although no charges have been filed yet. We're learning that the 75 year old victim was taken to Jamaica Hospital. He is said to be in serious but stable condition. In Rosedale, Queens, I'm Shosh Bedrosian, CBS News, New York.